some people, big up on yourself. Go on them, let me get something. So yes, my people, just a test out. I have a new machine that I buy. Hey, go towards my little thing. So I may test out, you know. And I fully ma master it yet because there are so many keys on it. Hundreds of keys that I have to get familiarized with. I don't know when that is going to happen. But we will see what happens. Well, right now, what I'm going to do, first thing first, big up my subscribers, them. Manners and respect. And then welcome to all the new people to the channel. And as always, may I say, if you love the channel and you love what we do with thing, don't be afraid to press the like button and also share and also subscribe. Yeah. What may I talk about now? I come to clear up a little thing that's been going on for a long, long time. From a little boy. This thing, me, I hear this thing. And this thing what I talk about is that thing where them say, one pum pum kill khaki. You understand? Man of us say, one pum pum kill khaki. No, if man say, boy, then I want to want no man in Campbell and the one burner thing because one burner to kill. Then something. Well, I'm going to tell you something now. Listen to me, I said, you know. Whether one, or two, or three, four, five, any amount, or even none, if you're something dead, it dead. And with the amount kill it. If it's something dead, it is just dead. Naturally dead. Yeah? But the thing is, the problem is where a lot of men don't realize. When a lot of men say, one, because you have a lot of men, you know. We have one woman found them a teenager and then grow up to boyfriend and girlfriend until they married and then live till they dead. And neither the man never go with the next woman, or the woman never go with the next man. Yeah, it happens. Yeah, but the thing is, why well, that man say that is because if you're in a relationship and you keep doing the same thing over and over all the while, the one style, mama and papa style, or whichever one style. After a while, it becomes boring. And it becomes boring in a way that you get turned off because you're not enticing no more. Yeah? Because of the one. So imagine, you just imagine you have chicken every day, every day, chicken, 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 chicken. You don't come to a point where you just, um, boy, I can't bother with the chicken, you know. The chicken, me, me just, for, you, for you hear about chicken, you come like, your belly full. Yeah. When you hear about chicken, your belly is full. You don't want no chicken because you tell them chicken every day. But if you are cooking chicken in a whole heap of different style, a chicken can cook a whole heap of you know, you can boil it, fry it, roast it, jerk it, this with it, that with it. Anything you can do with chicken. Curry, any damn thing. Soup, anything you can do with chicken. Then chicken now will become that boy because you're not, you, even though you eat the same chicken, but you don't eat the same recipe or you don't have the same menu all the while. That is what this thing is all about with the relationship and the man. And I say one something kill this and one something kill that. No, no, go so. So, I'm say a question now. Same if I say, yeah, I say one something kill your something. Then, what, what happened to the woman then? The woman could have said the same thing to you. Know? The woman could have said the same thing. But you know, man, or somehow we steer and we egoistic and we are kind of something we always seem to think different. So me I say, me I read that better me I say, then but me, some man, because one did that to a real talk, I said, some man, why is it that some man always want to have more than one woman or two woman? I mean, say, some, not all men do, as you know what I mean? But just like everything else, just like everything else, some things, what them say, inherit from family, it run in the genes. No, for, I think, personally, for some men to be going with more than one woman, this is my thing. I think it in them genes. Just like you can't have anything coming in your genes, you can have, like, you adapt, pick up cancer in your genes, this, Blood pressure in your genes, 
how can I say in, in your genes? Hazma, this, that, in your genes, that you can pick up in your genes as well. So, because who to tell? Maybe somewhere down the line, your, your four parents, four father, four grandfather, four whatever, whatever, from way down the line, back in the days, you never know. Maybe he was an African man. Well, most black people with this with with descendants are from African background. You never know. Maybe your great 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 grandfather was one of them man in the village where have maybe a six, seven, eight, nine wife, ten wives because it's a tradition in some culture for you have that. And maybe you were not in our genes. And it in your system, it in you. So no matter your try if you do, you can avoid it because it in your genes. But saying that, it's all a mind thing as well. It's a mind thing. Once your mind is in control, then you can do whatever you choose to do. And if you tell yourself, say, no, sir, whether I in my genes, or in my car, or in my polka dot, or in my whatever, it in me is a one burner. And I want a woman me a deal with. Because I can't bother with two. And I can't bother with three. I just one. But how we go deal with this one woman to keep our thing going and keep it lively is we have to change up the recipe and change the menu. That's all it is. So nobody listen to nobody and tell nobody and me hear nobody say about one sitting kill sitting. As I said before, if you find say you're sitting dead, I know they sit and kill it. It's something that's dead, naturally. Because, number one, a lot of men, they don't look after themselves properly. In terms of, they don't eat right, they don't sleep right, they don't do nothing right. Your body, they have to look after your structure. And by looking after your body, your body will be able to stand up to and resist certain things that will keep you going. Yeah? And two main important things, in anybody's life, two, the two main important thing, yeah, is the food and rest. Food and rest. Both of them. Two of them work together like mum and pum. Your food and rest. Because if you eat good food and you eat proper food, but you're not getting enough rest or proper rest, your body will still run down, yeah. And if you're getting proper rest, if you get rest and you not eat good food or proper food, your body will still run down. You have a bridge in the world, and at all. And he must say, how oh, sleep and he sleep and he sleep and in too much hours in sleep and he's still tired. He said, look, you know, man, he said, rest is good, you know. But at the same time, the source of rest alone now going to work out, you know. You sleep, you say you get enough sleep, but you still feel tired. That means your body needs Something your body need boosting. Your your can just a name fish and chips and not wrong with them something still. But you know some people or some people live and sandwich and this and that and that. You have to take the time out and prepare a proper meal for yourself to eat proper meal something good for your structure. Eat things that are beneficial to you. Don't eat things just to fill up your belly and say your belly full. And at the same time, you know do nothing to you. None of that. You have to. Do them type of things there. Uh. A young youth still, you know, as well, you know. Me I talk to me and tell him, you know. And they make me look back and me say, Tata, imagine all them a young youth, uh, when the team catch 38, and them tired already, so. Yeah? And what happened to them when they reach all my age? That's why I say, me sorry for a lot of the women them out there, because a lot of the men them want to see out there frame, a man frame them. They might dress good, look good, and, um, have money and big house and big car and big this and big that but that's all them have because where certain things is concerned them are going to let them in a certain department they are weak in a certain department because they don't look after themselves good you understand what I said though? so that's not a smile like a thing from the whole thing where man has say one pum pum kill khaki and all that kind of something man not going to say that man not a thing no go so. Not a thing no go so. You lose touch of nature because you're not doing the right thing. 
yeah and if you have your woman and you're really and truly in love with your woman yeah you have to just spice up your thing if you don't spice it up then it's gonna become boring and when something become boring you're not interested that is the thing not only you because the same man the same man where we say he not have no vibes to that woman let that woman not give him no vibes but yet he we have vibes for a different woman so that means they're not not doing not not do you then if that's the case so all the man never have fret and i worry yourself and i say boy one what do you think is now work and you don't know what I go on and it look like say not not do you not a thing not do you sometimes sometimes not do you you need to just look after yourself and yeah, your partner work on certain styles and certain positions and certain things and you know them type of thing the change up your routine instead of you do the same one thing over and over go in i mean go out come in go out come in type of thing change up your thing yeah change up your thing change up your routine yeah treat your woman like when you just first said meet her you understand what I said though? Now if the woman come up in a house and just lock up and now nah, care going away and you come in and expect everything are just nice and sweet and no. Treat your woman like when you meet her the first time. Remember you used to go out and you know go up on date and go on party and go on club or go on sitting. Treat her the same way. And by doing these things, sometimes the woman will come in like yeah, you go start looking for your woman on different people come like it's a brand new woman. Like at the first year meet her, enough man knows say when you meet a woman for the first time, how it go. You understand? If the fire is burning. Yeah? That's so how you have to do them thing. Yeah. Make your man dress up. Yeah, you man dress up and go out and you know what I mean? Spice up the thing. You get the message though. Spice it up. If I even even if you're not, you're not left out the same time, yeah. Tell her say, yeah, you got Go somewhere, go check somebody, and you want to have to meet you at this place. I imagine she will dress up and she will meet you. When she come meet you, all your woman you live with for so long, you know. When she dress up and come out, they come like it's a new date. As the first year I meet her, you understand? And you know, sit down and go have a few drinks and, you know what I mean? It's a different vibes. It's, a, it's a, like a brand new thing. But if at the same routine, you depend over and over and over, the thing will become stagnant. And when something becomes stagnant, the vibes and everything, as we call it, dead. Yeah? So this thing about this one sitting, not no go so. Not nothing, not at all. Not no go so. Trust me. As a man, me can tell you, no, no go so. I just, you feel just spice up your thing as a man. So anyway, people, this is just my little thought on this whole thing. I try to say we could have clear, cleared up as much. And people, please remember, leave a comment and thing. And I'm always willing to answer some some of the questions. There were some people ask, I can answer. Some of them make can answer. What me, what me can answer? Me answer. What me can answer? Me just cannot answer. Me a wait for Virginia. No, me I can't wait for here where I'm going to say. Trust me. Me can't wait for here where I'm going to jump down in the comment section and say, but this one is still. But me want me explain it as much as possible as I can still. Yeah? So my people, as I said, God bless, don't stress over a pest. Remember, I know one love, enough love. Anything we had, I could do it good to the best of our ability. My people, remember this, you know. We have to wise up, to rise up, you know. And last but not least, we have to educate, to elevate. Big up on yourself. Have a blessed weekend. See? Yeah, man.